Hi everyone, welcome to Mama D's house. Today I'm going to show you how to make a pineapple Hennessy upside down cake. So the ingredients you will need, three sticks of unsalted butter, three cups of white sugar, Gradually add your slip sugar and mix well. So three sticks of butter, three sticks, three cups of white sugar. So five eggs, room temperature. So you add one egg at a time or you can add two at a time. So that's egg number one. Number two. Make sure you scrape down your sides. Scrape the bottom of the bowl. Okay, three. Do not over mix your batter. Your cake will be dense. That's four. Five. Make sure your oven is preheated 350. I'm going to mix this well. Then I'm going to add, I have three cups of cake flour. This is the cake flour I use. So I'm going to add a cup of cake flour at a time. Continue to mix. I'm going to add a half a cup. So add one and one half cup at a time. And then mix well. And add another cup. I'm going to turn it down so the cake flour don't fly everywhere. I'm going to add in the remainder of the cake flour. So that's three cups of cake flour. Mix well. Don't over mix. Stop. 
Scrape down the sides. Give it a quick stir. So you will need a can of crushed pineapple in the heavy syrup. Make sure you pour the whole can in the mix, in the batter. Don't drain the juice. I'm going to give that a quick mix. Oh, it smells so good. One cup of heavy whipping cream to make it nice and moist and rich. So now I'm going to take it and scrape the bottom. Make sure you go to the bottom of your bowl. Let it beat for another two minutes. Pineapple smells good. Okay, now I'm going to stir it. No more mixing at this time, just stir it. Make sure you stir it well. I have a 12 inch bump pan. Make sure you spray it well. Okay, I have two cups and one three-fourths cup of brown sugar, two sticks of butter, I'm going to add it to the brown sugar, and I'm going to stir it until it's nice and combined. Make sure you stir it, no lumps. So this is a Henny, Hennessy pineapple upside down cake. You don't have to use Hennessy. So I'm going to add about three-fourths cup.
You're not going to taste the alcohol. This is not going to get you drunk. This is the base for the cake. I'm going to take that. Combine it well. I'm going to add to the pan. You can add as much Hennessy as you like. It's your cake. Make it the way you like. And I have some pineapple rings. I'm going to take it. I'm going to put it down in here like this. If you don't want to add the Hennessy, you can take the juice from the pineapple rings and add. You don't have to break up your pieces of a pineapple. You can leave them whole if you like. Now I'm going to take my cake batter and pour into my Pan. So this is a 12 inch bunt pan. Look at that. Nice and creamy. Now this is a lot of cake batter. So when you place it in the oven, make sure you place it on a cookie sheet. And make sure you spray your pan well. So I use Baker's Joy. Or you can do it the old school way. Add Crisco and flour. So I preheated my oven to 350. So this is going to bake for one hour and 20 to 30 minutes. Depending on your oven. Make sure you get cake three times. Get the hair blows out. Okay, I'm going to place it on the cookie sheet. And I'm going to place it in the oven. And I'll bring you back. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Mama D's house. The cake correction, one hour, 10 to 20 minutes, depending on your oven. Add one teaspoon of salt. So this is the end result of the cake. Very, very moist cake, so be careful when you take it out of the pan. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. All right, see you next time. Bye.